At that moment, a tug of war started between the buyers and the sellers, and eventually the buyer's escrow deposits were the ones that were in jeopardy. There was one time where one of our inspectors went to a home that had clay tile roofs. It was a single story property. Then once he got on the roof, there was a bunch of broken tiles up there, maybe like 20 broken tiles. So an inspector, you know, he took out, he took his pictures, he documented on the report what was wrong, reported it to the buyers. The buyers went back to the sellers and said, hey, there's 20 broken tiles on the roof. You know, we would like this repaired or credit requested. Well, at that moment, the seller said, no, 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 wait a minute. Those tiles weren't broken. Those tiles were broken by your inspector. And at that moment, a tug of war started between the buyers and the sellers, and eventually the buyer's escrow deposits were the ones that were in jeopardy. Ever since that moment, we transitioned to using drones whenever we have properties with clay tile roofs. It's very simple. Just go to your house, grab a nice clay potter, turn it sideways and step on it and see what happens. It doesn't matter how light you are. It doesn't matter whether you're heavy set or skinny. Eventually that clay potter is going to break because clay tiles weren't designed for people to walk on them. And that's why if the inspection company you are working with is walking on clay tile roofs, then that is something that could eventually put your buyers in jeopardy or put the negotiation in jeopardy. So make sure that the company that you're working with is using drones in order to check the clay tile roofs. It's very simple. There's nothing different that you are going to see whether you walk on the roof or whether you use a drone. The only thing that you're putting here is the liability that tiles could break and the sellers could blame the inspector or the sellers could already have broken tiles and blame the inspector regardless. Whenever you climb on a roof, the inspector is looking to see if there's cracked tiles on the roof, any holes, any openings, etc. The same thing could be done with a drone. So some people have an old school mentality and they think that just because you don't walk the roof, then it isn't being inspected thoroughly enough. Well, newsflash, on the surface of the roof, you cannot even barely tell if there's a leak unless there's an opening or a hole on the roof that's evident. The way that you could tell that a roof is leaking is by getting inside the attic and looking at the roof structure to see if there's any type of water damage or any type of leak evidence and on the, on the uh, ceilings inside the home also to see if there's any types of leaks or moistures. That's why we always use drones whenever inspecting properties that have these clay tile roofs in order to limit the liability that are placed on your buyers. Now, if you like this video or found it resourceful, please like, share, or comment below.